Welcome back to my channel. In this guide, I'll show you how to upgrade your unsupported Windows PC to the latest version of Windows 11 24H2 without needing a USB drive. As you can see, this PC is currently running Windows 11 23H2. Watch the video until the end to follow each step. Step 1, first, I'm going to download the ISO file from the official Microsoft website. I'll provide the download link in the description below. Step 2, I'll run the setup file from the ISO to show you that this PC is not supported. I'll mount the ISO in File Explorer and open the setup.exe file. You'll see that after checking the PC, it doesn't meet the current Windows 11 requirements. Step 3, now, I'm going to show you how to bypass these checks without needing a USB drive. We're going to copy all the contents of the mounted ISO from File Explorer. Go to the root of the C, Drive, create a new folder, and name it Win11. Paste all the contents of the ISO into this folder. Step 4. Once the copy is finished, open command prompt by searching for CMD and run it as administrator. Type CD followed by the path where you copied the files. In my case, it's C colon backslash win11. Then, type the command to run the setup. I'll include the command in the description below, and you can see it on the screen as well. Once you press enter, it will start installing the latest version of Windows without any hardware restrictions on your unsupported PC. When prompted about Windows updates, choose Not Right Now. Step 5. The PC will now bypass the compatibility checks, and you can accept the terms and conditions. Make sure to keep all your apps and files, then click Next, and finally install. Step 6, now, the installation of Windows 11 24H2 will begin. This may take some time, and your PC will reboot a few times during the process. Step 7, once the update is complete, the PC will reboot. I'll come back and show you the results. As you can see, the PC has rebooted, and I'm going to show you the version in the Windows settings. 
Go to Settings System About, and you'll see it's running the latest version of Windows 11 24H2. That's it. You can now delete the Win 11 folder from the C drive to free up space. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and sharing it.